Hello everyone, welcome to GANX. In this lesson, we are going to design a PCB layout for the power supply circuit. In last season, we already designed a power supply circuit. Open the red schematic, save the schematic, then go to tools, select net list to arrays. Then select cancel. We have designed a single layer PCB for this circuit. Then go to 2D graphics mode. Select board edge. Okay, now select your size of the PCB. Go to center. Here you can see the size of the PCB. Put it to zero position left click drag the line and selecting is a one inch thousand into thousand nearly one inch one into one inch pcb now go to components mode here we have components Rectifier, capacitor, or capacitor. I'm selecting rectifier. Single click. Place here. Capacitor. This is the connection between the capacitor and the rectifier. You can see the connection. If you rotate the connection, you can press minus or plus button in your keyboard. Make sure that the connection between select IC LED input if you over if, if the overcross these two components replace this one set to corner then select register Place output the shows error because it's overlap two components. Increase the size of the board. Otherwise. Remove this output. Place IC. Select. Right click on drag object.
drag object all the components go to components mode here no components all the components are placed in the pcb so now let's go to design rules here you have to select pad to trace clearance for handmade pcb at least it should be 20 25 or 30 and select 25 and trace to trace clearance also at least 25 go to net class select power then change bottom copper because we are designing a single side pcb then ok then go to layer usage ok layer pairs select all bottom copper ok then go to tools you can uh, root or trace by using auto router also then press auto router fan out pass 5 routing pass 15 cleaning passes 2 then begin routing all the roots are placed but these two are not placed these two red lines showing the red lines cannot design so that's why you have to use upper side jumper so now you can change the trace side also go to trace mode T20, T30 depends upon your circuit. Right click on the trace, then change trace style, select T30. Same right click on trace, then go to change trace style T30. then go to here output go to pre-production check pass all the test then close this is the final output of the PCB layout now go to file save the layout In output you can see the uh, 3D visualization of the board. This is the simple power supply board.
you can by selecting a text you can type name also selecting i am typing in okay in then go to output export graphics export pdf file here you select bo bottom copper only remove top copper top silk mac mac 1 no reflection is normal then okay So this is the PCB layout Thank you